Okay, another thing that the Attitude Era had going for it was the Monday Night Wars. If you don't know what that is, WCW versus WWF at the time, now WWE. I bring that up to say this. No, the WWE will not cannot be taken down. It's too much of a juggernaut, right? The indie scenes are going to do the indie thing, right? So the only competition they're going to possibly have is AEW or All Elite Wrestling, right? I'm not going to make any predictions based off of the personalities of whether it's going to be good or bad, okay, as a product. I don't know. I haven't seen it, okay? But if it is good, by the off chance that it is good and they have creative freedom, because I'm hearing a lot of wrestler, less, <laughs> wrestlers wanting to leave because of the lack of creative freedom they have in the WWE, right? If they, if AEW starts coming up because their their um, their owners are the Con family, they own the Jacksonville Jaguars, they own a team in England, so they got they're actually richer than the McMahons, all right? So they're billionaires, right? And it doesn't look like he's Ha he, he's not half assing this, okay? He, he's got some decent wrestlers, some old school wrestlers and some, you know, decent wrestlers, but it's all about the storytelling. And if, w, if, if AEW can tell stories, you know, they got Chris Jericho, and if you've listened to his, one big get they did get is Chris Jericho. And if you listen to the podcast where he's talking to Stone Cold Steve Austin, that dude knows how to work a match, and he knows how to work a storyline. Like the whole Shawn Michaels, I don't know if you guys remember, when uh, Chris Jericho punched Shawn, Michael, Shawn Michaels' wife, and that actually did happen for real, and then they had that epic ladder match where Chris Jericho lost half a tooth. They worked that angle for months. It was epic. I remember watching it. It was crazy. Right? So, and I loved it. You know, you never knew. Chris Jericho would come back, then, then you know, they would just really kick the crap out of each other. You got the quality of a Chris Jericho, and if he's lending to the creative team and giving them freedom, that man knows what the Attitude Era was like. If there's not many restrictions on AEW, then AEW, WWE better watch out, man. Because I'd switch to AEW in a heartbeat if it's that good. If it's that good. If it isn't, I'll probably stick with the WWE until they get her out, out of this funk. You know, you know, it's not. You can hire as many writers as you want, but you got to let the wrestlers have a little bit of freedom. You know, and let them be who they are. You know. So, but anyway, I'm, I say this to say competition is good. Okay, A having AEW as competition is good, and they will get their TV deal. They are going to get their TV deal at some point. And WWE is going to move over to Fox, which is also going to be owned by Disney at some point. Because Disney's taken over everything. Alright? Which is bad in a way, but good in a way. So, Alright, well, you guys, I just want to tell you that real fast. Competition is good. Love you guys very much. Crazy Dave signing out.